Hey there everyone, it's Haz here and today I'm going to show you all how you can get a permanently active 20% bonus to all your experience gained in Sea of Stars that you can get your hands on very early in the game and I would recommend not missing out on if you have a chance. There are lots of hidden treasures and secrets in the game overall, but this is something that's just too useful in JRPGs to miss out on, so let's take a look at it. So this 20% experience boost is, as you might have guessed, a relic you can equip and use, and it can be purchased in a secret shop in the port town of Brisk very early in the first few hours of the game. And without spoiling anything, I'm actually not sure if you can get this item later on. I'm not that far into the main story yet, so maybe if someone else got access to it they can tell us, but it's better to get it early just in case. Now it isn't as easy though as to just walk into a shop in the town, but first, you must get your hands on a key item that is available in a treasure chest just a little bit earlier in the game, in the wind tunnel mines of the stonemason's village. To get this item you must first unlock your wind magic to be able to fully explore the dungeon, and also pick up a mine ski that is in a chest on the lowest levels of the mine, right after you are first encountering Rocky, so it's really hard to miss it. Once you have the mine ski, you might remember a locked door in the first level of the mine, right before destroying the first rock elemental blocking the wind tunnels, and the key is exactly for that door to open, where after solving a quick and fun puzzle with the jade statues, you will be able to platform your way up to that unreachable chest on top of the rock in the room right beneath you. This chest will include the key item called the Trader's Signet, which is the requirement to be able to access the secret shop in Brisk, so in case you already have this item, but you wondered where to use it, now you'll know. Now one of my tips in any traditional JRPG is to always talk to every single villager and NPC you meet, because they usually tell all the secrets in the game, and they're basically your guides to finding everything. Just like in this case, where I talked with this elderly villager in town, who told me they saw someone irresponsibly swim under the docks, which immediately revealed to me there is something there that otherwise I'm sure I would have missed. All you have to do is jump into the water and now swim under the docks where the old sailor is standing, and you'll enter a hidden zone with the secret black market merchant who will ask for your special trader signet and will now give you access to bonus goods. A really useful trinket that will show enemy weaknesses next to their health, and also three really unique relics, one of which is the Tome of Knowledge 20% bonus experience you can enable for the whole game. Like I said, this is a pretty easy to miss secret if you're not thorough in your exploration, especially since there's a lot to explore in Brisktown, and even if you're able to get this later, it will be much later in the game I believe, and I'm not even 100% sure about this, so grab it instead early and use it. If you're a bit further into the game and you somehow got the Tome of Knowledge though, let us know in the comments without any spoilers, just so people can be reassured that it's not a missable item. But that is it for this quick video on how to get an easy 20% boost to all your experience in Sea of Stars people. Hope it helped and was fully understandable, I'm personally having a blast with this game so far, finding all the secrets and treasures, so if I find anything else really useful I'll let you all know, but also leave a comment if there's some parts of the game you'd like me to cover while reviewing it. Thank you for watching everyone, like and subscribe if the video helped, and I'll see you all the next time.